hey hi all in this video we will discuss about custom notification uh, call action which we have in flow how we can use it and what's uh, the feature or the functionality of a custom notification as in salesforce for an example you have an account that i have uh, for an example uh, you have an account that i have created one contact for that particular uh, account so you will be get uh, you will get a notification about that it can be a chatter post you can do it like in the previous video we talked about like how we can post it on a chatter in the same way we can just uh, we can just notify the account owner so as you can see there is a bell icon if i will click on that so there the greeting reads uh, so i will just hit and it says hey new contact created for account abc please have a look or have a look so in that manner if you want uh, to notify any owner or any customer any user you can notify them by using custom notifications which we have in salesforce out of the box so to create custom notifications and to use it in a flow first of all the first step is to we have to create a custom notification in salesforce for that we have to just click on the setup then just type custom notifications uh, you will land in this custom notification thing uh, so we have custom notifications as you can see we don't have to do anything in that just we have to give a name and an epi name and in which channels it will be supported you have to check box that like if you want to showcase it only uh, that particular notification in desktop then it should be desktop and if you want to showcase in mobile too then you can check the both the options we have to just specify the name and then we have later on we have to use it so this is the flow as you can see first we have get notification uh, get custom notification so we are uh, so custom notification is an object as you can see the name is custom notification type and uh, the developer name is new contact so as you can see the api name which is developer name of this custom notification is new contact so we are trying to fetch this particular notification custom notification by this so developer name equal to new contact yes we have that particular record only the first record will be fetched and all the related fields will be fetched okay then we have designed a custom screen so we can create a contact for that uh, account so the contact we have only two fields first name and last name uh, so last name is the mandatory field uh, on an contact that's why we are using last name then we have create contact in the create contact we will select object as contact and then the account id will be again the record id that we are getting from this page like in this page we have in this uh, lightning record page uh, we have a variable record id that is out of the box provided by salesforce well we are using flows and we want to pass any of uh, means like we want to pass the record id of that particular um, record which we are on so we can use this variable we, we will create this variable and it will fetch the url uh, it will fetch the id from the url of that particular account okay then we have first name last name the input the screen input and then we are getting all the account details why we require account details here because we want the account owner details then only we can notify account owner okay so we will select account and the field will be id and uh, id which will be equal to the record id on which record we are on that particular account then only the first record we want to save and all the fields then we have collection variable that is account owner id and we have used add operator so it will add how many accounts which we have related to that id but there will be only one record so that's why uh, we have used this to get the account owner's id user id okay then we have create notification core action in that we have not custom notification type id so get custom notification id so we have this and in this the id is there associated to this particular uh, custom notification that is this so we have just specified that in the core action 
then we have notification body so the notification body as you can see this is the toolbox we have notification body and notification title so what is the notification body so the notification body is to hey account name so we will just go to say hey new contact created from uh, for account or so this will be uh, the owner name and then we have new contact created for account then the account name and then have a look at the static uh, message or static static text which we have in that custom notification uh, apart from that we have recipients id so the recipients id will be a collection it will be it will be a collection that's why we have correct uh, we have created a collection variable and in that we have added uh, we have added that owner's id for an example uh, the collection variable where it is so th this is the collection variable if you go to it as you can see it will allow multiple values so that it will become a collection and that's why we have used this assignment to add all the owner id in this particular field and then we will use this particular field in the recipient's id okay then what will be the target id it will be the record id and then i if i will go to any one of the account for an example so this is okay okay so i think so the message sending custom notification is the name of that particular uh, so I will just see so this is the flow. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I will just set sending custom notification. The record ID will be okay. So the record ID will be passed and then i will hit save this we are doing to pass the record id which we have on that particular case from the url so now the changes have been saved so it's a sending custom notification contact creation so i will create contact abc and i then i will hit next this so as you can see there is a notification on this particular account the notification here a new account created account is abc have a look okay so in this manner you can create a custom notification and you can notify the users with whom you want to the owner of that particular record or uh, any specific list of people if you want to you can add that recipient's id you can create a collection of that and then uh, you can uh, add them in the target uh, id of that particular core action so yeah, thank you and have a nice day.